<clears throat> Hi, I'm Victoria Mitchell. I'll be performing a piece from Butterflies Are Free by Leonard Gersh. <clears throat> You're thinking, I don't look like a divorcee. They're usually around 35 with tight-fitting dresses and high heel patent leather shoes and big boobs. I look more like the kid in a custody fight. I can't really talk about Jack. No, I will talk about him. Once in a while, it's good for you to do something you don't want to do. It cleanses the insides. He was terribly sweet and groovy looking, but kind of adolescent. You know what I mean? Girls mature faster than boys. Boys are neater, but girls mature faster. When we met, it was like fireworks. I don't know if I'm saying this right, but it was a marvelous kind of passion that made every day like the 4th of July. Anyway, the next thing I knew, we were standing in front of the Jests of the Peace, getting married. I mean, there we were, getting married. I hadn't even finished high school, and I had two exams the next day, and they were on my mind, too. And then I heard the Jests of the Peace saying, Do you, Jack, take Jill to be your lawfully wedded wife? Can you imagine going through life as Jack and Jill? And then, and then I heard, Till death do you part. Now it's not even a wedding ceremony anymore, it's a funeral service. You know, wedding ceremonies are very morbid when you think about it, and I hate anything morbid. But there I was, being buried alive under Jack Benson. I wanted to run screaming out into the night, but it was 10 o'clock in the morning. You can't really just go screaming out into 10 o'clock in the morning, so I passed out. If only I'd fainted before I said I'd do. Thanks again, I'm Victoria Mitchell.